Good morning, good morning, Dr. Rob. How you doing? Another awesome and amazing day in the universe. And here sitting down in Florida, Sarasota, by the fire, fireside chat, but this is more about my daily intentions. And I have this great, there it is, great new uh, journal that I like to just kind of write and write and write. And I'm writing all sorts of ideas and uh, daily intentions about your positive life. And uh, my intention is every day, 365, 2019, share my thoughts. And um, are they worthy? Of course they are. Your thoughts are worthy also. Your thoughts are really, really, really important, by the way. Most valuable. And um, in the mix. All right. So life is full of lots of variety, right? And we're mixing it up. All right. We're bringing in thoughts from everywhere and anywhere for thousands and thousands and thousands of years. And we don't even know how long any of it really is, do we? Right. We, we don't know how long any of this shit has been with us. Right. And as I'm adjusting this a little bit, but Imagine that you have access to the infinite knowledge of the universe and you're mixing it all up to try to hone, to, to sand, to mold, to chip away at what it is. And remember, you may be taking someone else's thoughts, but you're honing them and making them yours and shifting and changing them in order to fit into the guide. And remember, we kind of start off as this mess of like chaos, right? And then after time, the pack seems to thin out and the, the leader seems to get to the front of the pack, right? And then there's this jostling for uh, the prime pole position, right? That's what we're doing every single day, right? And remember, what's most important is what you put in here and what you put in here. And find some philosophy that you find really fits the way to your daily life success. And we're all just in the mix, by the way, right? We're learning from so many masters of the universe, philosophers. It doesn't matter which one you're picking, pick one and read about it, write about it, talk about it. Listen, learn every day. We're humans on this crazy human experience, right? And every day, every moment, be careful of what's going on in this thing here, the brain, the God maker, I say the human brain is the creator of the thousands and infinite numbers of words, ideas, pictures, paintings, pottery, posts, all of this stuff is, but the human experience of life. And we are all kind of like in the mix. And one of my favorite drinks, although I really work on drinking far less, I have a martini every now and then extra, extra, extra filthy, dirty, a lot of olive juice, blue cheese stuffed olives, my only vegetable, by the way. And I know it seems crazy, but alcohol is not good for our bodies, by the way. It's bad. So is tobacco, drugs, smoking, marijuana, certainly heroin, cocaine. We all know LSD bad, even in these micro amounts, not good. Lots of fresh air, a lot less water, and one meal a day. And you're fueling the fire of your life. And what are you mixing? And sometimes you can mix the wrong shit and then you get all this stomach indigestion, right? We are placing into our minds and our mouth too much, which has these chemical reactions. Fermentation is deadly for us. I know, same stuff every day. But I was talking to um, a patient this morning, several, and um, you know, these ideas of, of fucking awesome ideas, but not to use any of these words in a derogatory way, but some reason they, they, they stimulate our, our listening and our learning 
and our drive to take pieces of the mix, pieces of the puzzle, and bring them together for each and every one of us. And I've been reading Deepak Chopra, Eckhart Tolle, ooh, so many masters of the universe, Jesus Christ, and check out Don Curtis, the Christ-based teachings, philosophy, by the way. It's all simple philosophy. The Philosopher's Stone, and don't forget to read The Alchemist, Paulo Coelho, amazing. Listen, read, every day, wherever you're at, whatever you're experiencing, do it with the joy, the gratitude, and the thank you God for this mess up in my life. And that's where the mix comes in. I've had some challenges in my life between my ex-wife, my daughter, my tia, my work, my friends, my family, oh, everyone. But that's part of the mix of life. And you have to imagine that God has put each and every one of these little pieces of the puzzle, these bumps on the road, in our way, in a perfect knowing of what's good and right and best for us. And every day I think about love, forgiveness, non-judgment, and I think, okay, can I not judge? No, no, no. It's judge with love. You learn, and don't forget to listen every single day. And as I share Mind, Body, Smile, Dr. Rob's, uh, Kiltz's Keto, uh, all sorts of crazy shit every single day, as a fertility doctor, I'm learning that what you put in here, what you put in here matters most. And remember, we're Ferraris, we're lions, we're eagles, and we're not pigs and cows. We're not grazing animals. And if it's too much of a mixture of too much variety and spice, it's not good for you at all. And remember every day to look in the mirror and thank you, God, and I love you. And by the way, I love each and every one of you, and I'm so grateful for your thoughts and ideas and your you're even critiquing and criticizing. I'm learning from all of that, and I'm learning to sit back and say, huh, how can I do this better each and every day? In the mix. You gotta get in the mix of life. You gotta risk failure, anxiety, worry, judgment, failure. That's being in the mix. Because life is full of the most amazing mixture of the universe. Just another human being or two, right? It doesn't matter where you're at, what you've been living, what your past is. But remember, what you want to be doing here is thinking the positive thoughts of the universe, even when the thing that's happening seems pretty not so positive. But imagine that God is always conspiring in your favor every day. And whether you're singing, dancing, writing, directing, poeting, potting, that's it. Get with it, this and every day. Hey, this is Dr. Rob Kilt's Mind, Body, Smile. That's it. What you put in your mind, in your mouth, gives you a smile of life. God bless. I'm working on the 365. It takes but 10 minutes each day. Remember, daily morning meditation. And it should be breath and smile and thank you, God, for this day. It's directive thinking, by the way. It's not clearing the mind of thinking because that's death, if I may say. God bless. Enjoy this awesome, amazing day. Dr. Rob Kelsey.